Right, so now we're back here. Um, there's actually a secret, I believe, around here somewhere. There's like a certain like button you actually have to like press, or something like that. I believe. That like lower a staircase or something. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Do not want that. I wonder if I can find it. Um... Anything? Oh, 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 no, no, no. I love my knives. Okay, let's just, uh, explore back here. Yeah, I think it was up here that I didn't get. Yeah, there we go. There's like something you gotta hit, I think. But where, oh where, could it be? Hmm. I think I might be a bit too far in. Most peculiar. Hmm. Right. I'm going to be right back, guys. And um, once I figure out the uh, the reason to this mystery. I shall be back to tell you all about it. Hmm. So we are back. Yeah, here we are. Yeah, hit this area right here. Hit right here. There was a secret uh, switch, which I believe you. Uh... Oh, okay, there, yeah, we hit it and um, brings down a little staircase here, a little attic. Frankfurter. Just a bunch of food, basically. Very nice, very nice. Resists. Oh, and platinum mail. Hmm. Right, I know this is probably not as good as um God's Garb. No, it's not, but um... Well, it's, it's not even good as good as a uh, diamond... Pl hmm. Alright then. But that's uh, probably like... When you first encounter this place, you uh, might not have the uh, diamond plate yet, so it's pretty useful, I guess. Right, now where shall we go? It's a big castle, folks. Okay, now. I'm, I've got like a map, basically, like, here that I'm like looking, looking at. I'm trying to like, compare it with my map and see... what areas I need to have. Okay, I think the big one actually that, that we need to uh, go to is Old Rock's Quarters. Because we missed out on some really cool stuff at Old Rock's Quarters. So I think I'll see you guys back at Old Rock's Quarters. So, be right back. Right, um, here we are again. And okay, I believe okay, if I'm looking at this right, it's actually on the ceiling is where we need to hit. Yeah, right over here should be. There we go. And this gives us the sword card which is actually a familiar that we 
and missed out on. Now the sword, I believe. You power enough to wield me? I like to believe so. <clears throat> the sword card is actually like very. Um, there's a lot of weird stuff that goes into like using him. Um, that I I'm not actually really sure about because I really never used him. But uh, it's like once you basically level him up enough, you like get like a certain spell or whatever that you can use with him, and uh, that gets like that can get like super good or something like that. So it's really kind of complicated. But we'll use him for a bit. Um, I'm, I think he, I remember him being like pretty nice. But um, the next place we want to go to is actually right over here. I believe. Is it? Where am I going? Wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. What the hell? Where am I? Um... Okay, we're going the right way. Okay, we want to go through here. And basically what the sword card does, if I haven't, if I haven't like, mentioned it or whatever, is it will basically just attack enemies just like the ghost card, but I'm pretty sure the sword card is actually stronger than the, than the ghost card, so, uh... can come in very handy. Which kind of sucks, though, because I'm pretty sure, like, the ghost card for me, like... Again, I'm not actually sure if I ever mentioned this, but, uh... The familiars actually, like, level up with you, basically. And, um, I'm pretty sure, like, the ghost card would have to be pretty high-leveled, considering how much I was using it. make this easier by just and this is what I'm talking about like unless like Konami has like officially said that like the highest percentage is 200.6 I actually think that there might just be like some other place that like pe no one has ever like made it to because like, there's so many like places where it just come like who would have ever thought to do that? Who would have ever thought to hit this random place here? Holy sword! Let's see how that does. I'm pretty sure, it, yeah, it's nothing compared to Alucard's sword, but gave us some um some area to fill in. It's always nice. Now where to, I wonder. Oh, actually. I was looking at this, okay. I think the next, our next, um... Goal will be... Downwards. To, um... both to fill in that little um, space that I forgot to fill in and also there's like a seat there's like a little room that I actually forgot there's like a little secret room that I forgot about um down by the catacombs I believe so let's go down there so I think I'll uh, I will meet you back there like in a second Right up here. Yeah, we got that part filled in. And that's basically that. Um, and now I think we'll be heading for the catacombs or whatever, so. Wish me luck and be right back. Right here we are. Bam, bam, bam. You know, tricky. Tons of peanuts and the power of sire. Right now, I'm gonna save it now because I want to check up what the percentage is. Because I think, right? I think at that, 
I want to say that maybe the first castle done. Maybe. Just looking around, right? Just like analyzing this. Right, I think that's that. But we're gonna save it and check the percentage just so we can jizz at the number. Because I'm pretty sure that number's gonna be a pretty sexy one. I imagine... I can't imagine it being any less than 196. So let's get to the save point over here. And then I think we're gonna head back to the, uh... The second castle. Going back to the future, pretty much. Let's so save that. And, uh... Let's check this number. So, again, quick cut. So, be right back. Right, so let's check this out now. 196.7. Nice. Nice. Right, so, let's get back in here. Now, let me just take one quick look. Right, just inspecting this map. Let's make sure we haven't forgotten anything. Because we have. That's going to suck. Because I can definitely see this, like, coming down, like, in the end. It's like we've like, missed, like, one little room or whatever. But I don't think so, guys. I think we've got everything. So, again, I'm going to be right back. And we'll meet each other again in the inverted castle. So, again, be right back. Right, so now we're back here, um, and I had actually missed out the secret version of one of the, um, one of the areas that we had actually just unlocked in the other castle. So this will give us some, uh, good old percentages. Ooh, and some money. I was actually, uh, I was thinking of, of it, um, while getting over here, the uh, the ability that I was actually talking about is uh, called Sword Brothers, I believe, and uh, it summons like some swords or something like that to help you out. I'm not really sure exactly what it does, but that's but it's called Sword Brothers. That's all I I just wanted to point that out. And I'm talking about the uh, if I've confused you or whatever. It's I'm talking about the. Uh, that ability that I was talking about for the sword familiar when you like level it up a bunch. Alright, so that's that. Right. So I think actually okay, um looking at this, the areas that we uh definitely need to get are we actually need to get back to um Old Rox's quarters, or like the reverse Old Rox's quarters. Um And uh, do some fooling around there. And um, after that, I think it might be time to go into the last areas of the game, um, which is basically the center of the castle, where we'll, where we will be fighting the final boss. Because that actually counts towards the percentage as well. So you never know what might happen but I'll um I'm gonna head back there again guys so again tell me if you heard this one before but uh be right back right we do it again and see where we are now actually wait have I done oh man wait oh there we go okay then I was getting kind of scared there thought I might have uh, been at the wrong place That, I gotta say, looks like some weird version of, a uh, looks like Goofy, right? Goofy, right, with a, uh, blonde hair and a bucket on his head. It's a heart refresh. What's that do? Restores 500 hearts. 
I'm not going to be needing that, but um, I can see how that might be kind of useful. Why would you? Why would you need that? Like, we got pretty much nearly like every heart max up in the game. Plus, we're level 52. We can't even have 500 hearts. Like, I guess that's just like if you're dangerously running low on hearts and you, and you like need them, use that, I guess, and you'll be safe. But um. Okay, next is to uh, one other area, right above this one basically. So again, I'll be right back. Right, I think this is uh, where, we need to, where we need to be. Um, if you look at that, we've got a uh, Lucky 7s as our health, that's all, always good. I'm just gonna... Oh, our magic is getting low. I'm just trying to miss past the, these guys. Oh yeah, look at that. Ooh. Fury Plate! I actually think I remember this, but I don't remember what it does. So I guess that kind of ruins the point. Defense goes up when damage taken. Hmm. I'm not really sure what that means. I think it might mean just like... When your health is low, your defense is up or something like that. Maybe. I'm not really sure. But after that, I think... I think that might be it. I think our next goal... Believe it or not, is the center of the castle, where we will confront our mortal fate and our father, Vlad Tippis Dracula. But first, I think I'm gonna be like just cut ahead again. To uh, a place at least a little bit closer to the uh, center because uh, we're pretty far away. And Wolfman, Jesus Christ. Uh. Let's save it here. Now let's see. Because it's the fastest way over there. That's not actually that far away. We can just uh We can get over there pretty fast actually. Just jump down here. I'll, I'll become like too used to like the uh the first castle now. I'm assuming that like every enemy is just gonna go down in like one strike. Oh well, oh, didn't mean to do that. Oops. Alright, so now here we are again, and uh, for our next trick, we will need a volunteer from the item selection, and that needs to be the uh, magic clock that can stop time. So hopefully we'll run into, run into one of those. 